find an expression for the function whose graph is the bottom half of this parabola. So let's just think about uh, parabolas for a minute before we jump into this problem. So as a simpler example, let's say you had x equals y squared. This is a parabola that opens right and it looks something like this. And if you were to solve this equation for y, you would get y equals plus or minus the square root of x. The top half of the parabola would be the function y1 equals square root of x. The bottom half would be the function y2 equals minus square root of x. So this is kind of similar. Um, it doesn't really look like this, but it's still a parabola that opens left and right. And you know that because the y is being squared. So whenever the x is squared, it's going to open up or down. And then whenever the y is squared, it's going to open left or right. Okay. So in this particular problem, just like in this fake example here, we basically have to solve for y. So we'll start by subtracting x from both sides. So we have parentheses y minus 1 squared equals minus x. And so now we take the square root of both sides. So take the square root, take the square root. Because you're taking a square root and you have a variable squared, you do have to put a plus or minus. And then the, the plus is going to give you the top half and the minus is going to give you the bottom half, just like here. So the minus will give you the bottom half, so we want the minus. And then we just add one to both sides. And that would be the equation that gives you the bottom um, half of the parabola. The top half would be similar, you would just take the plus case and then you would just have uh, a plus here. So interesting problem. Um, I hope this video has been helpful. By the way, this parabola opens uh, left. And I know that because when we got to this step here, we had this, and there's a negative here. Recall that the general, uh, the standard form for a parabola that opens left or right is the following. It's y minus k squared equals 4c times x minus h, right? That's the formula. And then um, if c is negative, it opens left. If c is positive, it opens right. Just some extra life knowledge. It didn't ask for that in the problem, but I'll just show you some more math. And then you could solve here uh, for c by setting 4c equal to negative 1. So c is equal to negative 1 fourth. It's less than 0, so it opens left. So, But you don't need to do all that. You can just tell it opens left from the negative, and that's not even that relevant to the problem. What is relevant, though, is that the plus is going to give you the top half, and the minus is going to give you the bottom half, just like in this simple example here. I hope this video has been helpful to someone. Good luck.